When you shoot the ball well, it covers up mistakes. Um, we made mistakes nights early in the season, and to Washington and Lee's credit, particularly in the first half when we made mistakes, uh, they took advantage of them. Um, we talked at halftime about trying to just be a little bit better defensively. In the second half, I thought we were better. But again, when you shoot 72%, um, it really covers up a lot of things and makes for a, a good evening for us. I knew Tanner was ready to play at the beginning of the game when he got an offensive rebound put back. And uh, we, we, something we've really focused on is trying to get offensive rebounds and, and improving as a team rebounding the basketball. And he was in the right spot as he um, as we coached him to be in the spot that he was in. He was in the right spot. He got a rebound put back. And then when he made those shots, and he also made a play, I don't remember exactly what it was, defensively in that stretch. Uh, so his play early on really set the tone. And uh, I think positive shooting is contagious. And uh, when he made a couple, and uh, Sebastian's really shooting the ball with confidence right now, um, it just carried over to the other guys. We want to be better defensively than we are right now. Uh, I, I think that's very important for this team to have success. And we gave up 45.8% in the first half, and we gave up 36% in the second half. We played better defensively in the second half. Um, that being said, it's not like we were awful in the first half. I mean, we're doing some good things. We have guys with long arms, and uh, they are now using their arms to, uh, to get deflections. And when you get deflections, you disrupt offense, and I think we did that effectively. We made mistakes. Um, we were not as alert as we need to be, and uh, Washington Lee made it tough. They run a really neat, tri I call it a triangle offense. I don't know what they call it. Uh, I thought they ran it pretty effectively in the first 15, 18 minutes of the game, and it made it tough on us. Um, so to answer your question, though, we need to be more alert, and then we need to eliminate some of the mistakes we're making. Uh, we made mistakes where they got very open shots. We, we want their, every shot that they take to be contested. And we didn't do that in the first 15 minutes. Uh, and they made us pay for that. So we got to be better at that. I thought we got some guys that got hot. Um, and uh, we, we were talking at halftime as coaches, you know, we're not really running our motion offense very well, but we are passing and catching very well. And uh, I thought we had guys that created open shots for other guys, and then we knocked them down. How about Harrison coming in with that dunk near the end of the game? Just describe his play off the bench the energy he gives the team. He's uh, exciting. He's an exciting player. Uh, he's a great person. And uh, he's a joy to coach because of his personality, the type of person that he is. And uh, you know, with his athleticism and his ability to make exciting plays, uh, it's, he's fun to watch. Uh, you can hear the crowd gasp and ooh and ah when he has the ball in his hands. That's neat. Um, what he did better tonight than he did Monday is I thought he defended better tonight. And uh, what we're trying to do with our newcomers, Christian, Luke, and Brian, is we want them to be able to play longer stretches well. And I think that's the case for any newcomer. But they can play right now 30 seconds, 45 seconds, a minute of solid play, and then they may have a lapse. So we're trying to stretch that out to a minute and a half, two minutes. And I thought Christian put a longer stretch together tonight. Regardless of who we're playing, we're playing. And we want to be as good as we can be. And I felt like tonight we were better than we were Monday night. That's important. And then the other thing is because we were ready to play and because we got a, a margin that we did, we were able to play different combinations. So that was good for us. I mean, you know, we, we had three, four people bring the ball up the court at different times. Um, so we were able to experiment with different lineups. That's why tonight was very important.